So here's the video of exhaust header cutouts through Granatelli. I went with two and a half inch pipe all the way back and I put the cutouts towards the rear. But right now you're hearing it through two and a half and an old factory muffler. There's the factory muffler with two and a half inch pipe. It's the old fashioned long. And here are the cutouts. Let's see how it sounds with uh, two and a half. So first of all, here's what it sounds like, just regular muffler. There's the two and a half with cutouts. So then what I wanted to do, and I learned that if you move your cutouts up to the front, you gain about 40, 50 horsepower from uh, Engine Masters, uh, David Freiberger. And while I was there, I wanted to go three inch pipes. So here is electric cutout at the header with three inch pipe. There you go. Straight out of the header, three inch collector to three inch cutout. And that looks like this. to the cutout, straight out of the headers. Now we're going to go the rear cutouts, two and a half inch. Two and a half inch rear cutouts. And that's good for like cruising around. It's not unbearably loud, but it still has a good like muscle car rumble. And then when you're driving through your, your neighborhood or it's late at night, then you can close it all up and go factory muffler. And that sounds like that. And that is quiet. You can hear the engine fan over the exhaust. You hear that? And now from here, let's go back to the two and a half. There's the two and a half cutouts at the rear opened up. And now let's go header three inch. There you go, definitely louder. Now just for the fun of it, let's go the header three inch and two and a half open at the same time. See if there's that makes a difference. Now that's both open. I don't recommend that. It kind of gives a little bit of a different sound. It's kind of neat. It's not bad. 